In this video, we're talking about what a leader is. We are not getting into the rights of wrong of their agenda, but we're going to talk about a little, little barbecue pit here in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Now, this barbecue is run by Adam Skelly. Adam went on Instagram and said, well, first, heads up. Toronto and the area have gone on another, their second lockdown. Um, but Adam went on Instagram and said, I'm not shutting down my restaurant. We are going to remain open. We are not the health problem or the restaurant industry is not the health problem that the government wants to pin on them. So he stayed open. Uh, Adamson Barbecue. That's his restaurant. Why would I say this is what leadership is? Right or wrong? I mean, he's, he's breaking the law. He's keeping his restaurant open when it's been uh, told that they need to be on lockdown. But he's showing great leadership because, listen, this is his livelihood. As a leader, sometimes it's sink or swim, fight or flight. He has made a decision. Right or wrong, he has made a decision. He can't run a restaurant if there's nobody coming in and if the government's forcing them to close. He can't feed his kids or his family or whoever his dependents may be himself. Can't feed that when there's no money coming in. What about his employees? Restaurant industry, you know, it's, it's a check to check kind of thing. Like you're a cook there, you're probably not making big bucks. You're a server there, you're relying on the tips. Government's not, not covering that. So he made a leadership decision for himself and his team. We will remain open. What's going to happen to him? I don't know. I can't say regarding the mandated closure that this was a good decision by Adam and his team, but I'm not in his position. He is. They are. Decision had to be made. He made it. Media is not being kind to him. He's telling them to beat it. I don't know. If you ask me, right or wrong, this is a sign of leadership because he's made a decision, he's chosen a direction, and he's moving with it. He's not being swayed. He's not being bullied. <laughs> he might be paying some fines, but he's doing it. He's standing on his own two feet. That's part of leadership, okay? I'm not telling you guys to fight the law because usually the law is going to win. But there's a saying, if you stand for nothing, you're going to fall for anything. This guy stood for something. Now that we're done here, check this video. I'll meet you there when I'm done my coffee.